Hello everybody, my name is Cube 6 here and today we're going to be taking a look at this really cool redstone torch combination lock. Now, I know what you're thinking, what is this? It's just a massive wall with a gold block and a door. Where do I put my redstone torches? And uh, I will solve that really quickly. Pretty much you have a master redstone torch key and that's what the gold block represents. All you have to do is go ahead and place a redstone torch on that gold block and as you can see, the arrays fold away leaving these gaps and uh, that will allow you to place redstone torches in those gaps and that's pretty much how you will control the combination lock. Um, now you don't have to have this feature but it's just easier to reset it if you mess it up. Alright so pretty much how does this work? So all you have to do is go ahead and place your torches down inside these little grooves here and if it is the right combination then the door will open and as you can see it is not the right combination. So the door will not open. Now if you want to reset it it's pretty easy instead of just destroying each one individually you can just go ahead and destroy the master torch and then all of the torches will fall down. So in this case I do know the combination so let me just go ahead and input it so pretty much it can be any combination as well any picture I like it like this little X and everything will break allowing you to walk through the door and into the redstone so here is all of the redstone for this design as you can see there's a lot of observers and pistons making the whole thing work now the cool part about this is that you can completely customize uh, the whole entire combination by just changing these redstone blocks out the back so as you can see that is a completely different combination this and then I think that and then everything will get reset and uh, a with this design, it is actually uh, super easy to reset. It's just uh, once you take the torch off, then it will instantly reset everything. You instantly reset that individual module, and this is the individual module right here. So there's a few other things happening in order to make the door open and the uh, gold block push out. Pretty much all we have is a pulse extender. We have some note blocks down here, and then this is all like really jumbled up and messy. But uh, and then we've got to go into the door. Uh, but pretty much that is how it is done. So yeah, it's a, it's a really cool redstone contraption, a really cool uh, combination lock. And again, and uh, I haven't said this yet, but it is actually infinitely expandable in this direction and infinitely expandable in this direction. So you can end really in any direction. So you could have potentially a massive uh, combination and uh, it's virtually incrackable unless they're obviously get behind and then see the combination with the uh, redstone uh, blocks. So that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show off that. If you guys do want a tutorial on this design, then please shoot that in down in the comments below. I will be glad to make a video on that and explaining everything, all the little details. If you guys did enjoy this video, then please make sure to leave a like. That would be greatly appreciated. If you have not subscribed yet, then please make sure to subscribe. Uh, that would help me out a lot and grow the channel. My name is Mr. Cube 6 and I will see you guys in the next one. And uh, goodbye. And you deserve And you deserve